The best ways to celebrate Earth Day. Educate yourself. Look around your area for community events with speakers, film showings, action booths, and organizations that are making a clear effort to help protect and restore the environment. Look up and learn a little bit about your ecoregion. Here's Oregon, and I live in the Klamath Mountain ecoregion characterized by ponderosa pine, incense cedar, and Douglas fir trees. Volunteer. There are numerous volunteer opportunities for planting native plants, removing non-native invasive plants, cleaning up trash, working on trails. These are my favorite things to do. I'm based in Oregon and I am going to list some things that I've found, so if there are any Oregonians watching, you may be near some of these events. For those in the Portland area, you might check out wisdomoftheelders.org. In honor of Earth Day and the missing murdered indigenous people, they will be holding a special event. They will be making showy milkweed seed balls for dispersal, and I wish I could go, but it is a little bit too far for me, so if you're in the area, please check this out. Another one for Portland, the Forest Park Conservancy will be holding an Earth Day event. You can also check out the Solve website. They have a lot of volunteer opportunities. Here you can see the map. Click on the areas closest to you and look around and see if there's an event that you would be most interested in. From Portland to Ashland and up and down the west coast of Oregon, you have opportunities. The Rogue Valley is having their own Earth Day event April 19th. And close to the southern Oregon border, we do have Mount Shasta. National parks will be free April 20th, so enjoy free admission to national parks that normally require an entry fee. Don't deprive yourself of the beautiful nature of our world. In addition, national parks in your area may have volunteer opportunities this month, which can be a great way to honor Mother Earth by giving back, as well as being immersed in the nature your DNA vibrates to. And maybe you're too busy most times of the year, but perhaps for Earth Day, you will make time to give back with your community. For some events, you may just need to bring yourself, but read the descriptions as you may need to dress appropriately or bring your own tools, including snacks and water. If you are in Oregon and know of any Earth Day events or restoration projects, please comment them below the city, county, or website. It doesn't even have to be an Earth Day event. Find an activity to give back to Mother Earth. Be aware that there are other projects happening around you all the time. Earth Day is not the only time to do right for Mother Earth. We can also avoid plastics, bring our own reusable bags to the grocery store, buy from local small businesses and organic farmers markets. The less processed food and junk food we consume, the less garbage we make. So consider incorporating homemade meals into your everyday week. Bring a refillable water bottle with you when you leave the house. We can also grow our own food and share with our neighbors, plant native pollinator flowers, and clean up non-native invasive plants on our properties. These are habits that lessen the impact of harm on our planet and they are very worthy habits to adopt if you haven't already. We can also spend more time in nature. Humans are not meant to be separate from the land. Spend time on the trails near you and learn the native flora and fauna of your area. Teach the next generations to value the land and resources and empower yourself to be educated in your natural environment and discover the importance of protecting the ecosystems that we depend on for our survival. I encourage you to do something meaningful this Earth Day that will make the world a better place. We have the power to lift Mother Earth from the oppression of human harm by becoming the solution to the problems our environment faces today. We can be that change. Shout out to all my starseed, lightworker, hippie, barefooting tree huggers. This is your call to action. Honor thy Mother Earth for 5D ascension and assimilation. We are one. Live long and prosper.